In the darkness of the cinema, hearts race and breaths grow shallow. Eager viewers find themselves transfixed by the terror unfolding on the screen. Their palms clammy, eyes wide with anticipation. A tale begins, weaving an intricate web of fear and suspense. It grips young minds, older souls, and everyone in between, regardless of where they call home. The horrifying journey unfolds, testing the limits of courage and resilience. As the tension builds, the unrelenting sense of dread takes hold. It's in these moments, as nails bite into flesh and eyes dart nervously, that the true power of storytelling comes to light. It's a shared experience, uniting strangers as they collectively hold their breath. Immerse yourself in the eerie world of horror, where even the bravest souls dare not speak. Our first tale of terror is Hereditary from 2018. Directed by Ari Aster, this psychological horror follows a grieving family tormented by a demonic entity after the death of their secretive grandmother. The film's psychological manipulation was so intense that some viewers couldn't bear to watch it till the end. Next, we have Lights Out from 2016. This film played on our primal fear of the dark, with some audience members deciding to stop watching midway through, fearing they wouldn't be able to turn the lights off again. Then we have Silent Hill from 2006. This movie was so disturbing that some viewers wished they could unsee it and had their eyes closed for the last 30 minutes. Our fourth tale of terror is The Fly from 1986. The disturbing scenes in this movie made it difficult for some viewers to watch it in one sitting. Finally, we have The Human Centipede 2 from 2011. This film was so disturbing and creepy that some viewers couldn't even get through half of the movie. Viewer experiences can vary greatly, and what is disturbing or scary for one person might not be for another. Always check the content warnings and reviews before watching a horror movie. Until next time, dear viewers, remember, the real horror is in the unknown.